Welcome back, guys. We're doing okay. We have repaid all our debts. We have just over a million in the bank. And it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. Our lines are making money. We are making money pretty much every month. Once in a while, or every fiscal thing. Once in a while, there is one that is in the negative. Uh, simply because, I guess, the timings are just off on delivery so that it goes in the negative but i mean fine negative 142,000 in one fiscal thingy but in the others we make almost half a mil i can live with that all right now i had big plans for new york <laughs> really big plans but those plans are dead in the water because uh, i wanted to deliver goods from over here to new york but to make goods, we need steel and plastic. Steel needs uh, iron ore and coal. Mm -hmm. Now, coal. We have a coal mine here. We actually used to have two coal mines here. Uh, so one of them has closed without me noticing, but we used to have two, uh, but one is fine and we could deliver coal over there. Uh, we had two iron mines up here that are both closed i knew about that uh, and that puts a spanner in the works because we can't make steel without well steel without uh, iron ore so yeah that's a problem and it it, it was a really cool setup i had planned so we, we have our oil up here which is uh, by no means being used to the to its full extent we could bring oil down here make plastic pick up crude on the way back and pick up more oil making money both directions just hand over fist hand over fist uh, we could have plastic going down here in boxcars delivered here pick up goods deliver them to new york and go pick up more plastic because th they both need boxcars so it would have been a real money maker a real money maker but alas it wasn't to be because the industries went out of business which is fair enough uh, they didn't have any customers so uh, you can only stay open for so long right now instead what we're going to do is we're going to hook up fuel to San Antonio San Antonio San Antonio wants 67 fuel we have some crude here so an oil well we have a oil refinery here and we have a fuel refinery down here so we are going to pick up uh, crude send it down here to the oil refinery pick up oil send it down here to the fuel refinery and take it back to san antonio that's the plan we might actually turn it into two lines so that we do crude to oil and back and then we do oil to fuel and back and then the crude train can take the fuel back to san antonio that little bit of the way i think that's how we're going to do it and we do have an extra oil well down here which can be an extra delivery of oil or, or crude to the oil so that we have enough that we are actually full both ways all the time i think that's a really good plan so um let's get started we do have a bit of terrain to deal with a uh, little bit it's not too bad most of the way it's basically down here that we have the problem. This bit. This is gonna hurt a little bit to get up and down of. Well, up of. It's gonna hurt to get up. It's gonna be fine to get down. Uh, but I do think that we have the general coming soon, which will alleviate some of that problem because the general is a much much better train than the baldwin that we have now 
Uh, but let's start building. We'll let the game roll on slowly. Very, very slowly. Because if one of these industries decides to close down in the middle of this, I, I, I just might start, start crying. And I don't like crying. So... We'll put you in there. I don't think you're connected right now. Uh, um, are you? No, you're not. Uh, so we need a little road to connect you up. There we go. You're connected. Uh, another thing that I would like to do, uh, because Sac uh, uh, San Antonio is a pretty decent sized town, 202. Sacramento is a pretty decent sized town and Grand Prairie up here is a pretty decent sized town so putting a passenger line between those three would be really cool and so that's a second project in this area but let's uh, let's finish the first one first and find out what we do about the next one um I think I think I kind of want the station here, but I think it's worth, even though it costs a bit of money because we're going to tear that building down, I think it's worth doing that and then sticking in our station. Um, like so. Okay, then we need a station down here, and I think we'll want it on this side, so we need a bit of road here as well. And let's see if we can't do that. Just a tad, like so. And get a station in here. We can edit these later if we find out that it's not practical that the goods are being dropped off or picked up on one side or the other okay now i want to plan for sacramento so i guess we'll have a station down here uh, and that's okay but we need it to be somewhat like this. Boom, in you go. Then we want a station here as well, but we want it on this side, I think. So can we get a road in? Uh, yeah, we can. Okay. Uh, let's make this a little bendy and put a road in there and I think yeah, we want to go down that direction so we want to go this way so we'll put it in here then we need a station down here and down here we definitely want a terminus and we can just put it at the end of this road i think yeah something like uh, something like that okay that's all those in and we haven't taken our loan yet this is promising but we are going to take our loan now and that means that we're going to pause the game for a bit because we're just going to take our load of five million and get all these rails in and i think i'll do that off camera so 
you don't have to sit through me painstakingly do that. So uh, I'll be right back. All right, we are all built up. We are all built up. So we have our rails here. And we are coming all the way down past here. We have our uh, crude stop there as well. Coming in to the fuel down at Sunnyvale and going back. And we spent around one and a half, well, three and a half million of our money. We're going to borrow the rest. And that leaves us 6.4 mil, which is in reality enough to give us three trains. Which is what I think I want to do. So let's set up some lines. New line uh, from here to here. And why are you having a problem there? Uh, oh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I see. I see, I see, I see. We have a little snafu here. Uh, because these need to be able to go in both directions. So we need to be able to cross over here. And we need to be able to cross over here. Where is it? It's there. Okay. And then we can put a signal in there and there. And this should hopefully uh, fix our lines. Uh, so why can't you connect? Ah. We need to put in a platform on the other side here. No, because you're only going to there. So you only have two stops. San Antonio South to Sunnyvale. And in Sunnyvale, why can't you go out that way? Is there a little hiccup in our line building or in our track building? There probably is. Let's just see. Not that. Let's see, this looks good so far. You're not stopping there, so you should be able to go through that. Is this a double slip switch? Yes, it is. Though it shouldn't really matter. Here. You should be able to go this way. You'll be able to go there. What the heck is the problem? Uh, what if we switch San Antonio South out to be number two? Doesn't solve the problem. Just switches it over to use that. So why do you not want to go down that way? Is this not a, not a double swip? No, it's not. Now it is, and now it works. Beautiful. So is this not a double swip either? No. Needs to be. All right. So that's line number one, uh, as it's aptly called. Uh, cargo, uh, fuel production, um, and I guess it's down in Sunnyvale that we're actually producing. So Sun Rail. Okay. New line from there to there to there and here apparently we have a problem as well why uh, 
the grandparent down to here well down to there okay it's because we can't drop there so we kind of need to put a cargo station on the other side here so configure platforms why can't I put a platform in there oh because it's not okay I get it I get it okay so configure you now there's still something in the way there so annoying uh, we'll lose that little bit configure uh, tracks in here we will need to change this up at some point but that's okay all right all right like so and let's put these tracks back in there okay so in san antonio south we want you to be on on one uh well, what we want you to be on that side so i guess we want you to be on two why can't you get back over there is this not double Slipping? No, it's not. So that's where we have our problem. Okay. Let's try this again. Signal or a track. Track. Go into there. Track. Go into there. Then track. Come over here. Uh, okay. Then track. Start from there. And then you come over this way. Like so. Guess we'll start up from here. Uh, you need to be double slip, double slip, double slip. Uh, signals in there and there and in there. Okay, now. You can get to down there. I want you here in San Antonio. I think I want you over there, and that solves the problem. Wonderful. And I actually think in San Antonio South, we'll put you over on one. So that you're like that. And we will tell you in San Antonio South that you can use the other one as well. Okay. And the same goes for the other one. Cargo, this one. Uh, in San Antonio South. You can use that one as well, if you like. Okay. And then... The next new line is going to be from here to here. And in San Antonio South, you can use both, if so needed. It's going to be uh, 
cargo, production, oil, um, stan, rail. Okay. And this one is actually called the same cargo production uh, oil actually we could call this delivery instead no yeah delivery uh, fuel delivery and rail okay now down here and we do have a five bypass line so that's good that's good now that is everything that we need except i would like to get a little cargo station in here preferably without having to for a building Suppose we could do it like this. That seems to work. Let's put you in there. And then a little drop off. Uh, let's put the drop off over there. Uh, new line from there to there. This will be cargo, fuel, delivery. Uh, sand truck. I think that's it uh, all we need now is a road depot uh, which we will put in over here why not okay so let's just see we have our lines we have cargo production oil san antonio rail which is this one we have uh, uh this needs to be renamed but we can do that in a bit cargo fuel production uh sunny mail so that's this one then we have cargo fuel delivery which is well the truck is that one and the train is that one okay i think we're almost good to well we are good to buy our stuff Buy our trains, buy our trucks, well, wagons. Uh, all right, Baldwin. Cargo, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And you, oh, you don't have enough power for a high. So I think we're going to have to go with six, which is unfortunate. But again, I think the general is right around the corner uh, so cargo uh, oil production san antonio rail buy another one cargo uh, oil production uh, well fuel delivery no fuel production uh, oh, that's not the one. Uh, it's cargo fuel production. Sunnyvale rail. Yeah, there we go. And then another one for delivery. That's the three trains. Let's buy cargo 
Let's just get three uh, for the San Antonio fuel delivery. And wouldn't mind getting another train, but we can repay this and save a bit on interest there. And hopefully uh, start making some money very, very soon. Okay. Well, we have a train on the tracks. Oil production, San Antonio Rail. And we have a little bit of money. So let's put that in there. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Do we have crude sitting here? We do. Do we have crude sitting down here? We do. Fantastic. That's a very, very good sign. That's a very, very good sign. Okay. Taking that track, which is fine. Was this a double slip? Yes. It seems like everything is working. Everything can get where it is. We have no warnings. You're going to come down here. And... You're going to take this switch. And come in here. And pick up some crude... 42 of the stuff. Noise. All right. You're gonna head back up the right side of the track. Beautiful. And look at the landscape here. It's gorgeous. We have the river down there, we have the uh, mesa thingies, I guess they are. They look so cool though. They look so cool. And we're taking the middle track. Beautiful. Beautiful. And... Up we come. To our delivery place. We're heading over here to deliver. That's fine. And first revenue on that. Oh, and there's the general. Right after we made all this. Of course. Um, let's see, you're down there. You're there. We still have a train in here? No. Do we have a train down here? Yes, we do. We have a train coming to pick up. That was quick. How, how did... I guess it came in here and then turned around. Noise. Noise, noise, noise. All right. This is going to be a big deal, I think. This is going to be a big deal, I think. Now, what I am thinking is that if we... No, no, not repay. If we borrow this money, can we then, with this train, uh, replace it with the beautiful, beautiful general and some more cargo? Um, let's say 63, 917,000. We absolutely can. Replace. And let's take a look at the general. Because the General is a pretty train. 
It is really, really a nice train. Look at that. It's a beautiful train. Was that the wrong train I replaced? It was, wasn't it? Yeah, I wanted to replace that one. Darn it! Never mind. Uh, maybe we can undo it. Actually. Uh, if we... Manage you. Say... Uh, replace... With... The Baldwin. And... One, two, three, four, five... Like that. All right, we get 818,000 back. Good. That means that we can actually replace the right trade, which is a uh, which is preferable. I I prefer uh, replacing what I actually plan to replace. Uh, what if we took one off there? Then it comes. 14 and 45 well 45 26 14 45 24 13 that's fine that's not that big a difference but no matter if uh, i replace the wrong train it's still a dang beautiful train it is still a dang beautiful train and it's going to make us a lot of dough. A lot of dough. It's awesome. I do like the general. I think it's a really pretty train. Very, very lovely. Okay. Do we have oil sitting here? We do actually have a little bit of oil sitting here. 20. Now, I do want to replace the other train. Where is the other train right now? It's there. Because now the Baldwin is going faster. It's not a lot, but it's a little bit faster. Oh, you're coming down here to drop off some goodies. Let's see how much you make in a delivery. And remember, this train will be picking up the fuel and bringing back here. So it'll be making a little bit of money going the other way as well. Which is fantastic. Let's see. What, what do you make? What do you make? What do you make? Make money. Make money. 253,000. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. You don't have anything on board yet. Horse. Okay. How much is sitting here waiting? 62. So you are actually going to get pretty much a full load. Pretty much a full load. That is fantastic. Let's go, General. And you're full again, of course. Indeed you are. So, of course, it'll take a little while for all this to start making a profit, but a profit it will make. A profit it will make. And then we'll get the passenger line going as well as the next project. And it's just going to be wonderful. It's just going to be wonderful. Can't wait to see what you make when you come down here. That's going to be wonderful. Let's see. Uh, I want to see what you make as well. We didn't see last time how much it made on delivery. Hopefully something sexy. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. 174,000. Okay, that's pretty good. Now we just need to see what the general makes. 
and then we will call it an episode. Ooh, it's struggling a bit, the journal now. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. Oh, it's heavy. Are you going to make it? There's still a ways to go. Didn't it say that it was 13 on the highs? I guess this is very, very high. Oh, we are picking up a little bit sweeter in 10 kilometers an hour. We certainly haven't made money yet on this, but yeah, we're, 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 we're losing a bit of money right now, but it just needs to kickstart itself. Then it'll be fine. And then we will make money. Oh, we're up to 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Go, go, go. You're picking up another full load. Fantastic. Good job. Uh, let's ride this bad boy in almost all the way. Chuka, 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 chuka. Oh, listen to that horn. I like it. Oh, that sounds so good. That sounds so good. All right, we're coming into the station. We need to see how much we make. How much do we make? How much do we make? 646,000. Ka-ching! That is nice, and of course you didn't get anything with you back, but next time, you will. And as soon as we can, we'll buy you a sister train. Because, let's take a look at uh, the rates here. So, cargo, fuel, fuel production... rate of 35 that's not the best we need to double that uh, what about the oil production uh, where's oil oil production san antonio rail rate of 56 and the last one the Fuel delivery, San Antonio Rail, a rate of 30. So we need two more trains on those at least. Well, one on each. Uh, but San Antonio is gonna get some fuel and we are gonna make some money. And that is what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. Man, I'm looking forward to this. Why? Oh. Uh, and I can't afford to put in the... Need to put in a, a signal there and a signal there. But we can't afford to do so right now. But we are out of time. So I'll let this run for a bit and we'll see if we make a profit. And next time we will be building our first passenger line from Sacramento to Grand Prairie via San Antonio. And I think it's going to be a great thing for us. I really do. So yeah, uh, thank you so very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.